Free condom test, let's go. Have you noticed all the different types of condoms there? There is the market leaders that, for copyright reasons I can't say who they are, but you know who they are. And their condoms can go up to like 20 quid or something like that. But there is condoms that can cost under a pound. And there's also free ones. They just give them away for free. What I want to know is, which of them is actually the safest? I'm going to put each category of condom under an extreme stress test. And whichever condom bursts first is the worst. Okay, so here we are with the free condoms. Oh god, my mum and dad are absolutely going to kill me for doing this. Right, yeah, we're doing this in high pressure, fuck it. Oh man, this is going to be awful. This is going to burst. How the fuck is that still going? It has to burst soon, surely. Good, I've got a lot of respect for condoms now. Jesus Christ. Oh! Jesus Christ. Oh! I forgot to time that one, so I'll put the time on screen now. Right, I'll get my stopwatch ready this time, and we'll be doing the cheap condom test. When I say cheap, they're really cheap. 89 pence bought you 14 condoms. 14 condoms? Even if you had a baby, imagine all the money you've saved on condoms. Oh, fucking hell. They're the worst. <sighs> These are for the smaller gentleman, I think. That's a pretty city. <laughs> and we're off. Oh god, this is terrible already. I think there's a hole in the side already. Oh Jesus, look at that. I'm going to have to disqualify this. That is disqualified. Look. It's still shit. I certainly hope these aren't the condoms that I was using with my ex-girlfriend. Although I do hope that these are the condoms that I found in the bin that my ex-girlfriend was using with another guy. That'd be great. More around me are familiar. Okay, moving on. <laughs> the cheap condoms. According to my stopwatch, around 19 seconds. There was already holes in the condom as the test was going, so it's really zero because that's the whole point of a condom for no holes to be in it. <laughs> so these are the market leaders. If the price is anything to go by, these bad boys should last quite a while, unlike the actual users of them. These definitely smell the best out of the bunch. If smell is an important thing to you, these are the best. <laughs> my, my seal of approval. And we're off. No holes in it. That's a good start. We're still going. We're still going. We're at 37 seconds now. And we're still firing away. Must have been no fat in November. Oh shit. Oh, fucking shit myself when that happens. Oh, shit. Right, that was around 45 seconds. Right, science. Um, if I were to recommend one of the three, it would definitely be the market leader because one, they smelled the best and they did last the longest. So remember, according to the condom test, only use the best. I'm going to clean this all up before my mum gets in. Thanks for watching and please do share this if you enjoyed it because the BBC said that if this doesn't do well, I have to do a flavoured condom test and when I smelt that shit, I'm not putting that in my... Just please don't let this... Go shit.